First, we believe information is power. It also helps lead our decisions and can even help us streamline our days. Atlanta News First Sawyer Bussey spoke with community leaders about the habits that fuel their days in hopes of sharing some of that information that could improve your life at home. We all adopt habits along the way. Some of them helpful, some of them less so. But what if the habits we adopt can help us live fuller, richer lives? It can take a couple minutes to make a connection. A simple hello, a quick acknowledgement of someone else in the room. Well, habits also come with sometimes structure, right? It kind of gives you structure to what you do. It's part of your routine. Maybe it's some creative way you decide to bring people together. Maybe it's a simple way. Maybe that way is by bringing your best friend to work. Lovely. She makes me feel, oh, I just want my dog. This is going to be my dog one. This is Cumberland Academy in Sandy Springs. The school was created for kids who have autism, ADD, ADHD, and other learning differences. This is a place who says their mission is to help each student feel seen and supported for each student to thrive. We get here, we get out of the car, we run and play in the gym, and we hang out with the kids. And I greet the kids in the morning, and then we have announcements. And that starts my day. That's my habit. Cali is the safe space for any student or teacher who needs a break, who needs a moment, and who might just need a friend. I still love Cali no matter what's going on. She's still right by my side. She struts, not walks with her head held high, and the kids gravitate towards her. She's not only a blessing to me, but to our students. And they're a blessing to me. So I, I get to have the best of both worlds. Our lives are stressful and chaotic and can at times be overwhelming. It's those moments of connection when we realize we're not alone in this world that can mean so much. Callie is a daily part of life here at Cumberland, and maybe there's something we can all learn about making space in our lives for a little bit of connection every day, even if you don't have a Callie. In Sandy Springs, Sawyer Bussey, Atlanta News First.